don't care where you are in the world, if you're going by the bitch, you need to have these items. I'm going to show you guys the essential items that you need for a great bitch vacay. I can make it right. If you're new here, please subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell button so you get notifications every single time that I post. It is summertime and you know what happens in summertime. You know we gotta go to the beach, we gotta go swimming, we gotta go for a holiday. You know, I've been waiting for this for so long. And so I'm super excited for you. So today I'm going to show you guys the essential items that you need for a great bitch vacay. I had to go shopping and check out some items that I think everybody needs to know about. As you can see, I'm already in my top that says Aloha. Guys, I am absolutely in love with this top. I got it yesterday and I do have some other colors in this. If you like it, just let me know because um, these are going to be available in my store in Tanzania. It's at Segula underscore look underscore expensive. You can buy this there from around mid-August, but you can book it right now so that I can get your specific color. Um, for now, I have them in white, uh, pink, and dark blue, as you can see, and black. And so you can pick whichever size. Anyways, guys, as you can see, I'm already dressed up in a hat. I'm not sure if you can see me. I kind of had to turn on my light because it is dark outside. Like, it's about a rain. I don't know. But I here, I got a statement hat, you know. And I've got this humongous bag filled with bitch goodies. And I can't wait to show you guys what's inside so you know next time you're going to the beach what you need to carry. So, let's get to it. So a lot of people say when you're going to the beach you need to have a swimming costume and it's the most important thing. I will tell you this, the most important thing is actually sunscreen. This is something that a lot of us, especially African people, we think we don't need but we really need it because my skin can burn and so can yours. And yes it's true our melanin be saving us a lot, we are not as sensitive to it but our skin tends to get hurt as well you get burns or and our burns can occur in different way you can have like a burn which is like you know you don't understand what is this and it's like an excessively dry part of your skin and it's just it's peeling off it looks like you got hurt but you don't know when yeah that's a type of burn or you get really dark you know it's not exactly a burn it's more like your skin is like not today bro you be like light all the other places and your face is like so the first thing I usually cannot forget to pack is my sunscreen. So I have two types of sunscreens. This is the first type of sunscreen I use. This is a cream screen <laughs> and I really like it because of how it is on my skin. As you can see it's creamy, it's milky and when you spread it it's like it's giving your skin a whole new cover. You can never go wrong with this. So here we go. As you can see you can actually see like my skin has like some sort of like layer on top of it and guys come on there is no burning this part this is the second sunscreen that I've got this is from Nivea this is um we usually call it Nivea whatever you call it Nivea Nivea potato potato this is oil based so here it is and it, it's like you know like coconut oil <laughs> it reminds me of coconut oil just from the texture of it and you can see I obviously like this better because it's like it kind of just dries up on your skin and this is like I feel like sometimes I'm cooking myself with this but it works quite well and uh, I really really like it second thing that I like to pack is actually my lotion just because usually when you go into the ocean you know with the salt water or the sea wherever you're swimming by your skin gets really dry black people can relate I'm sure I mean if you have skin like mine bro I am gonna be looking drier than charcoal so you need a lotion so this is the lotion that I use Evelyn cosmetics it says it has 24 carats gold and guys when I got this at first it says 24 carat gold I thought they were messing with me like who's gonna put gold in their lotion I thought they were playing turns out it's true this thing is golden see see uh, my skin is sparkling right now 
I have it on on me because I just love glamour so why not I thought this is the best that I can use for the bleach because if I'm not gonna shine in the bleach I don't know where else I should shine another thing that's a must-have is a hat look at me now I'll take it off and show you guys so this is my hat I am all about large baby if I put this on I don't want any ring to like just touch my skin you know cuz I'll be gorgeous like that it even has this little ribbon just in case it's really windy okay so I have this thing that will just strap the hat to my head I feel like some grandma somewhere but it's cute so this is the bay so moving on to the more cool stuff shorts I mean how can you go to the beach without a pair of this they almost look like skirt oh look at that body <laughs> <laughs> this is just perfect it's like guys I wish I could give you this stuff these are a second type of shorts that I've got as you can see again it's a very comfortable I love the bow tie very breathable and I like them for it um, I like the polka dots I feel like they're very playful and just perfect for the bitch another thing that I was completely sure I needed to get were a pair of palazzos. Here is my palazzo. I have this in black and in cream. What I love about them is that they're extra long and like when I walk it's like my foot is still inside this palazzo and I think that's just the point. Like if you're going to the beach you need to have a couple of different options. I have them in khakis as well and I love them. I really, 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 absolutely love these pants. Um, this is more like a skirt. You know, you just... I mean, I'm gonna style all these items. Make sure you check out this video on Instagram and you're gonna see how I've styled each and every item. As you can see, I have another skirt that I will be taking with me. They're almost like this, but they're blue and probably you've already seen them from New Yorker. And I'll show you in a bit. This is another skirt that I have also been totally abusing. I'm just showing you this stuff real quick. But if you want to see how I style all these items, be sure you check them out on my Instagram page. I also managed to get this cute kimono. It's a fishnet. As you can see, I'm all about breathing. It's not exactly clothes, but I, I was thinking to get like um, something, maybe like just something I can tie around but it just goes like this and it's really long at the back it goes all the way down I got these cute slippers I got this from Jumbo as you can see last year I got them in mouth but I really like I thought I should just go with black because I noticed this year I have a lot of dark colors and black which is funny because usually I go for lighter colors for the beach but I don't know what happened this year. Like I have these ones, they're like mermaids and probably I would also bring them with me. This one says mermaid. The problem with this is that usually the salt water tends to rub on it, off it and I get really disappointed and I'd rather just buy something that's just plain and just be done with it than just buy colorful stuff and then just see it break before my eyes. Speaking about feet, here's my anklet. This is, uh, I'm gonna open them right now. So this is how it looks like and I'm gonna put it on so you can see how it will look on my leg. So as you can see, it's right over here. Here you go. So that's the anklet, baby. Maybe I'll add some more just because why not. And now for the best part, the thing we've all been waiting for, the costumes. So here is my first costume and i absolutely love 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 it i'm gonna come closer so you can check it out properly as you can see i love this total bohemian ish style it's completely i, I can't explain <laughs> and like how they are see in the sides it's just super sexy and i super love it here is the bra for the costume um it gets tied up at the back uh like this as you can see and at the front like this and I think these are total to die for uh, if you're in Bulgaria you can get this costume from Jumbo it, uh, it costed me like um, I think 12 lever for this and 9 lever for the for the underwear so this is my first set my second set is kind of like a Frankenstein <laughs> set but I hope you like it here is the bra again I'm gonna come closer so you can check it out here is the bra 
this is where the neck goes it goes kind of like this and here's where the neck goes and this is how you close it at the back I really liked it because it's just it was so relaxing and I really love the pattern the reason why I kept saying it's Frankenstein is because I paired it with these underwear that actually got them last year from another um uh, another swimsuit but I never wore it because it kind of like disappointed me like I didn't get how to do the suit so I just kind of abandoned it but I got this there and I thought okay instead of buying a different set for this although I think black underwear would look better on it I think this can also work and I had to get me a one piece costume and I got this from crop it's very simple and the back is really cute because you can totally adjust the back it's like this at the back it goes like this and it's totally cute you guys and I think it's a bit difficult to like just be able to pick out what costume is best for you and I think I'll do another video on that maybe the challenges of actually picking out the right costume or what should you really look like what you should really look for to pick the right costume let me know if you want me to do a video on that I wanted to get a dress but I the dress that I wanted was this beautiful polka dress I just I wasn't sure it was gonna fit me so instead I opted to go with something I can wear even after and if you've noticed almost everything that I've picked apart from the kimonos and the costumes I can wear them anytime and that's what I go for mainly I got this extra large t-shirt it's a just plain white but it's just it's okay it's I love it okay as you can see it goes with my hat okay and without forgetting my super duty glasses tell me tell me there you go that's all I need to go for that's all I need to know I totally love buggy stuff and I love these glasses I just cannot explain it's like beyond explanation and these glasses right here are totally to die for if you want these glasses once again they will be in my store it's a gula underscore look underscore expensive it's the new um, stock that I'm putting together and it will be probably online by mid-august so once again if you like these glasses and you want this I don't know hat glasses whatever you want let me know if you've seen something from this video that you like and you'd like to buy it from me I will put it in the next stock that is being shipped to Tanzania very soon I am a weird person and I'll tell you the other thing that I always must go to the beach with is a bottle of water just because I know sometimes when you want to buy stuff from the uh, the sea size or ocean side usually they charge it very much so usually I put I come along with my bottle of water and this is really small and cute and very easy to carry it has a filter inside and I can like put detox water or any kind of water that I can just put it in I also got like a good mat it's uh, actually a towel now you can get a mat but Christian is stingy so he won't let us get a mat but I prefer a mat because the sun it's annoying if you just have like a piece of clothes to put on the beach but anyway if you really cannot get something that's hard enough you can always go for a towel since I've mentioned all so many things I will need a place to put them and here comes my bag baby here is my beach bag that's gonna be filled with everything that I need from my lotion the sunscreen whatever you name it that needs to come with me is coming in this bag for that day these are the extra things that you actually do not need to carry but if you want to go to that extra mile you can bring a cooler a cooler for like just to put your own drinks if you're gonna be going with your own drinks um, you can just fill it with ice and just put your own like drinks and just let it get you know cold and you don't need to buy drinks all the time because most of the time the seaside the hotels there are a little bit pricier so it's always better to go with your own drinks and if you're not gonna be renting the place that they hand over to you at the beach it's better to go with your own umbrella as you can see so it just comes like this you've just gotta mount it together and they're perfect you have your own umbrella I hope this video was super helpful let me know if you need to ask me any questions be sure you go to my Instagram so you can watch how I've styled all of these items step to step so I hope that you enjoy it and thank you so much let me know if you like this content don't forget to subscribe like share don't forget to hit the bell button I'll see you guys in my next video bye